Welcome to Catherine the Paint. Today I am once again messing with the balloon technique. I have some primary elements that I'm using today. I have desert clay. Not that one. <laughs> A little bit, tiny bit left of the northern lights and I have cyan, Amsterdam, and okay this is the desert clay. I know this one is called Azurite, but I'm not seeing the container. Here it is. Right here. Azurite. Okay. Let's get to it. Putting down my pillow, which is just house paint, semi-gloss, and with a little bit of water in it. And all my paints are mixed the same with the pouring medium I made out of the polycrylic. That's the clear gloss. And this Sherwin Williams that's available at Lowe's. And it is the ultra deep base. High gloss. Interior, exterior, high gloss. Ultra deep base. That's the most important part. It's non-tinted. Don't let them tint it. You don't want any color because this is just to, for, for your colors. You're gonna mix them in with the colors. So you're adding your own color. All right, gonna to need to pop some of those bubbles. <laughs> well, with the house paint, they just never go away. I haven't started. Well, I did start a little bit with that stick. But anyway, even when I don't, they don't go away. Okay. I am actually going for a certain look, which is crazy because, you know, it's the bloom technique. Who knows what it's going to look like? <sighs> but I kind of want to look like the ocean, like where you can see water, but the water's all over it. So start with the azurite. And I'm going to use more color this time because I really want the whole thing to be covered with color. Put this as the desert clay. This would be like the sand in the ocean and some of the brown spots. You know how it is. You don't know what I'm talking about. Draw some cyan. I'm going to put a little bit more of the azurite. And I'm going to finish off this northern lights. There's not a whole lot, but Better use it than lose it. I think it'll add a nice shimmer. Okay. Now I'm going to use my topper, and it does have a little bit of flow troll. It's Amsterdam white. I'm gonna put a dollop there. I'm gonna put a dollop here. All right. All right. Blow straight down on each of them, then I will blow them out. Okay, that was straight down. Now we're gonna blow it out. some lacing here, not enough here. I'm going to blow on this one this way again. Okay. Okay. I'm going to slowly start stretching it. I think I'm going to go this way first. Okay. 
Stretching is the slowest part on this. <laughs> it takes a while. Patience is good. Okay. I'm going to pull it back to the middle. Now I'm going to bring it back to the middle. And we'll go off this side. Yeah, I don't... Gonna bring this back to the middle. Okay. I am happy with that composition. I just need to touch up. I think that is it, guys. Let me wipe my hands and I will bring you in for a close up. Here's the close-up. The colors are stunning. It's very, very dark. Much darker than I had really meant, but look at that blue lines. It's like a blue-green line through there. So pretty. There it is, guys. Thanks for watching. I hope y'all are enjoying this journey of learning the bloom technique. I really appreciate you guys. Thanks for watching. Be inspired.